Golf is a difficult sport at the best of times. It may seem simple, but getting the ball in the hole in as few shots as possible is not as straightforward as you might think. Now add a disadvantage like a disability and the sport becomes incredibly challenging. That is not the case, especially for the likes of Daniel Slabbit, the defending South African disabled golf open champion. He has not allowed his disability to get in the way of the sport he loves, and now he returns to the tournament he has triumphed on on four occasions to take on the best the world has to offer. For the last two weeks I've had a lot of nerves. Um, I've been thinking about a lot about the tournament and all the guys that's coming from international point of view. Those Oaks are they good golfers and stuff, so this year the game is going to be raised a lot more than any other SA Disabled tournament that's been played. This will be the 18th edition of the South African Disabled Golf Open. It will see 74 of the best disabled golfers in the world doing battle here in Pretoria. Over half the field is under 18 handicap. That means that there's some serious talent on show. And to get all the golfers together bodes well for the future of this famous tournament. Um, we've got 74 players playing in all different disabilities. We've got wheelchair, we've got visually impaired, we've got deaf, leg amputees, multiple leg amputees you've seen. Um, and arm amputees. I think this is going to be one of the top tournaments in the world as far as, as, far as our, our top players go um, because all our internationals that we are bringing in are under five handicaps. It is customary for the members of the media to get an understanding of how difficult it is to play with a disability. Golfing journalists were asked to try a shot balancing on one leg off the tee while hitting the ball with one arm and then being blindfolded while putting. The thought-provoking exercise has allowed the golfing scribes to appreciate the effort of the disabled golfers. It goes to these guys because to hit the ball that far, especially the likes of Reynard Shootnut, you know, he hits his driver like 300 plus with one hand. It's amazing. So I give them like, you know, heads, uh, heads off to them. And again, you know, to putt blindfolded. I mean, it's, one, it's not one of the easiest things that one can do because you only rely on your feel and that's it. These truly inspirational golfers make this challenging sport look easy. Despite their disabilities, their passion for golf and their determination to do their country proud against the best the globe has to offer just proves that they have overcome the obstacles in their path and have instead allowed themselves to find a new lease on life playing the sport they love so much. CS Duplessis, CCTV, Pretoria.